For she's a jolly good fellow, for she's a jolly good fellow, for she's a jolly good fellow. And so say all of us. And so say all of us. Hooray! And so say all of us. Hooray! For she's a jolly good fellow, for she's a jolly good fellow, for she's a jolly good fellow. And so say all of us. All right, all right, all right, settle down, settle down. <laughs> hey, birthday girl. Hey. So, as you well know, one of my favorite things to do ever is to surprise you because <laughs> you make one of the cutest surprise faces ever. Yeah, you do. And, <laughs> and I just thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy that. I mean, this is the same look that you had on your face the first time I showed up for our very first date. At your doorstep in the pouring rain. Yeah, yeah, you say, you say, yeah that, that's it, that's it. This is the same expression that you had on your face 19 years ago. Wow. When I asked you, as a low level accountant, Why do you have years, to say low level? Because humble beginnings. Well, let's know where we're coming from. All right, all right, continue. Thank Sorry. you. So, as a low level accountant, and I asked you to be my wife. And over the years, I have grown to love this face in all <laughs> with all of its expressions from the highest highest most exciting times to the lowest moments ever and the crazy thing is I love this face so much that no matter how I feel when I wake up to it how I feel about it and the person who owns it Aww. never ever changes Aww. I love you baby Aww. happy birthday Happy birthday, Eddie! We love you! Yeah! Go, 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 go! Take a wish! Deep breath, deep breath. Okay. Make a wish. Hi, Tutu. Hi. Did I catch you at a bad time? No, 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 it's fine. Are you sure because you sound... No, no, no I'm, I'm fine, I'm fine. Oh, okay. Um, the investor wants to meet by um, 7 p.m. on Friday. Just wanted to find out if you'll be available. I'm available. Friday is fine. Okay, great. I will just send you the details then. All right, thank you. All right, take care. <laughs> Friends, huh? <laughs> uh, so let me get this straight. Uh, you want me to believe that uh, she's doing all this, going through all this trouble to get you a job because she believes in you and she just wants you guys to be friends? Yeah. Man, <laughs> get the hell out of here with that bull crap. Honestly? You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> I don't expect a selfish prick like you to understand that there are people out there who just want to be selfless and help what? others. What are you talking about? I am selfless as it comes. What? I, look, are you dizzy? <laughs> yeah. Bro, one example, yeah? Of the time, in recent times, when you were selfless. Go. Focus. It's easy. I'm a doctor. That's your job. Now your job be that. Okay. All right. You want selfless? Okay, let me, yeah, I'll give you selfless. Um, Here we go. Yeah, this morning, yeah. Uh, I gave Dami mm -hmm. the most amazing head in the shower. And I didn't even hey, have to hey, return hey. it with a blow. Guys, stop now. How is it? I didn't say selfless now. I didn't ask for that. selfless? That's as selfless as a gift. She is even your wife. Okay, now, you, now your job is that now. Okay, all right. I 
thought you said you wanted selfless. Yeah. I, I, yeah, that's yes. as selfless as it gets, right? Wow. <laughs> you know what? My point is, mm. two single, mm -hmm. beautiful, successful grown-ups mm -hmm. can't be friends without wanting to shag each other. You don't look too, too well. I mean, you, you get that I have four. What's it? And you see a fine-ass girl like that, and you don't want... I mean, you don't even feel anything. Look, that's not the point. What is your point? Point is, I'm trying to focus on what my priorities are. One, providing for my kids. Two, getting a job. My God, you sound like a broken-hearted widow. What? Well, technically, newsflash, I am. My wife passed. A year ago. I know that. I was there. Yet, yes, my wife passed. So act like it, eh? Go out there. Get wild. Live a little bit. You have no idea how lucky you are. Toby. No, no, no. no. I, 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 I don't mean I'm like that. I mean... Uh, you know what? I beg. You're a mess. Uh, you know? Wow. Sorry. Uh. <laughs> don't look over those two girls. I think so they did check us out. They my guy said, don't look. I don't have eyes at the back of my head. Hey, you just don't they look. What, what do you mean? What do you mean, us? Taking us? Us? Yes, as in me and you. Guy, news flash. See your left hand. You're married. I know that. You. So, there's nothing wrong with looking now. I know if you look again. I might not be able to do anything, but at least I know one person who can. You know, and when a girl is checking you out, you're supposed to impress her. Impre how? Why? How? Sure, I'm eating a clippity if you get all this deliciousness you're going to give her. Oh, boy. Give her, my guy. You know? <laughs> okay. Oh, you know what? Hold on, hold on. I'll show you how it's done. Just watch me. Guy, don't stop. Stop. It will end in tears. And yeah, she my bestie. My love for you is endless. Nobody else can end it. Yeah, I think I pulled a muscle. But, but, but I warned you. <laughs> That's what I get for trying to impress. But uh, there are serious issues here. Uh, this doesn't make any sense. Mm -hmm. And I'm telling you, I found that in the, in the drawer of, of, of uh, his office. Ah, then it could belong to any of our staff. Guy, you read the messages now. Did you see those Guy, don't even go there, alright? It's too early to make that kind of assumption. Ah, for all we know, this can mean anything. I don't know. Come on, man. Think I'm now. Ah, deep down in your heart, you know you married a good woman. She was madly in love with you. And her family was her world. She'd do anything for her. So, I, 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 I don't, I, nah, I can't. Look, Toby, all I need is, 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 is just some clarity. I just need this thing to make sense, that's all. Do you know what? I think I know someone who can help with some answers. Remember Mrs. Kijo? Mama Kijo? Yeah. That, that woman that never smiles. Well, I think her phone has been disconnected or something. I, I can't get through. But but if you do get in touch with her, please ask her to contact me as soon as possible. It is urgent. Okay. Yeah? Just, just do me that favor. Thank you, John. No problem. Bye. Everything is fine, Mama. Just, um, are, are, you, are you done packing? Yes, my bags are packed. Okay. The kids were quite helpful. Okay. Maybe I should stay a little longer. No, 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 no. Mama, we already talked about this. You have to get back to Enugu because you have unfinished businesses that you have to just go and focus on. Hmm. Hmm? Especially now that you're busy trying to secure a new job. Mama, we'll be fine. You worry too much. Besides, I don't know how you remaining here is going to help me get in another job sooner. At least someone will be watching over the kids while you focus on business. Mama, we'll be fine. Hmm? Adora is more than capable of taking care of herself and her siblings as she's back on holidays. Besides, they have Dami and, uh, and Toby. So just cheer up, okay? We'll miss you, but we'll be fine. Miss you too.
I'll be okay. Dad, can we please watch some manly TV? This girlish stuff is getting tiring. Girly stuff? Yes. Daddy, tell him that's discriminatory. Kelechi, you really cannot say girly stuff, you know, in the 21st century. It's discriminatory. So please stop that. I'm going to head out now, so you guys try not to burn the house down, will you? Thank you. Uh, we'll try. <laughs> Very funny. You have jokes now. Bye. Bye, Bye. Dad. <laughs> Official. You and your boys are crazy. <laughs> it is actually very, very, very possible that we're all crazy because you know, I wasn't even expecting um, him to. David, hold on. Who is it? What now? Can you ask Kelly to let me watch E? Why not allow Kelly watch what he wants to watch? We've been watching our show since. That's your show. Just because I watch it with you all the time doesn't mean I'm interested. Okay. Since you're such a smart mouth, why don't you go and sit down with Kelly? Why are we even talking about this? We have two TVs for Christ's sake. So why do I always have to be the one to compromise? You're the youngest. You don't get to choose. Why are you always taking his side? <sighs> No, mm -mm. don't get comfortable yet. Go, just go. Go and sort out whatever you have with Kili. Can you just leave me and my life alone, please? Hey, David. <laughs> I'm so sorry, my siblings are a lot. Nah, babe, that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? No? What are you doing? <laughs> Hi, um, Tutu, I'm actually driving towards, um... Good evening, Mr. Dickey. This is Evelyn. Evening. evening, evening. Oh, um, Mrs. Kijo. <laughs> I got your message that you've been trying to contact me. Yes, yes, I have. Yes, ma'am. I hope everything is okay over there. Mr. Dickey. Well, actually, Mrs. Kijo, everything is fine. I just, I just need to discuss something with you rather urgently. Is there a problem? No, 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 no. I would just really like to, you know, sit and have a conversation with you sometime tomorrow, maybe. <sighs> but I'm leaving for Kutono tonight. Tonight? Well, in about 30 minutes precisely. If it's not so urgent, we can always reschedule. Um, wow. Um, so, okay, Mrs. Kijo, when, when are you back? In a month or two. I'm not too sure. Um, what? Okay. Okay, you know what, ma? Um, I'm coming over right now. Yes, ma'am. If, if you would just please text me your address, I'll be with you shortly. Thank you. Oh, Mr. Dickie. So, where is, where is everyone? 
uh, my dad went to this event thingy. And my little brother should be in the room lying to these little girls on the phone. I see. <laughs> my little sister should be uh, right here. Oh, Cosy. Shit. Uh, aren't you supposed to be sleeping, darling? And aren't you supposed to be too tired to be bothered and want to be left alone? <laughs> She's so funny. Yeah. Um, this is cool, Cozy. Cozy is such a cool. Yeah, yeah. Cozy, this is David, my boyfriend. Hi, David. Hi. It's my pleasure to finally meet you. Wow. We've heard so much about you around here. Dad would be so pleased to know you're finally here. Really? <laughs> Uh, um. <sighs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> Remember that gypsy cut dress with the spidery black lace bodice I've been asking you for? Mm hmm. <laughs> you, you can have the dress, Kusi. Mm -hmm. May I have some of your chocolates? <laughs> <laughs> yes, of course. You can have some of my chocolate cake. Thank you, big sister. <laughs> wow. Isn't she adorable? She's a piece of work. Yeah. Um, it's a house. <laughs> it's a really big house. Right? It's even bigger with, without a crowd. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My dad likes to make an impression. I see. You know, it's not only your dad that knows how to, you yeah. know? You make an impression. <laughs> you made an impression you made the first time, baby. <laughs> yes, silly. Really? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> let's go out. <laughs> Get out of here. I'm serious. Let's, let's go out. See, there's, there's a really bomb party at one of my friends' place. Right, I really don't want to go in on, please. Plus, everyone has been dying to meet you. David, I can't. I can't leave my siblings at home. What are you, the nanny? Come on. They're adults, they'll be fine. I guess, but someone still has to keep them in check. <sighs> you always do this, come on. Like, even in school, we couldn't go out because you were always volunteering for some stuff. Or carrying the class on your head. <laughs> Well, I have to study hard to stay in school so I can keep dating your lame ass. Yeah, yeah. But what about now? You know, we made a deal with that point. Go out more here. Hmm? David, my dad would be really pissed if I leave my siblings at home. Okay. So I guess we just um, watch TV. Right? Okay, yes. <laughs> Wait. Nayo, what are you doing? What are you doing? Mr. DK, what a pleasant surprise. It's so good to see it's you. so good to see you too. <laughs> How are you and the children? Everything all right? I'm good. The children are fine. Everything okay. is fine. And, and I'm really sorry for, no, for intruding no, on you no, like no, this. No, no, no. problem. I was just going to see my family in Cameroon. My daughter just put to bed. That is great. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you very much. Wow. <laughs> no. So, well, since it couldn't wait, then it must be serious. So, what is it? Ms. Kiju, I, um, I went to the restaurant a few days ago. The 
restaurant? Yes, I, I figured I'll just stop by and you know take a look around since it's been closed since Ehi passed away. This is Kijo. I found something in his office. What was it? A phone. A phone? Yes, a, a cell phone. And um, someone has been sending messages to that phone. What type of messages? Private messages. <laughs> you were the manager of the restaurant and you know that place as, as well as he did, so I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that you can give me some insight. Mr. Dickey, I'm sorry. I, I have no idea. The restaurant had an official contact number for business and it became unavailable as soon as the restaurant was closed. <sighs> Look, Mr. Dickey, A he loved you. She really did. She always spoke highly about you and the children. That's how important you are to her. I'm, I'm sorry. If I'm, I, I really shouldn't have put this on you like this. I'm, I apologize. You don't need to apologize. I understand how you feel. A's death was a big blow to all of us. Jimmy, thank you for saying that. And, and thank you for your time. Have a safe trip. Thank you. Yes, Wait. My regards to the children. Uh, um, this is Anna Yodike, and his husband. Who's this? Hello? 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 How do I begin, begin to say my mind, oh? Dead men don't cry, I, I should be running away I, I feel so different these days Everything's falling apart I know I'm dying inside You were devoted, oh, oh yes I noticed but some truths keep coming back a 